Air pollution is a serious problem in many cities in Asia due to a variety of factors including rapid urbanization, industrialization, and transportation. The Air Quality Index AQI, is a measure of the concentration of air pollutants and is used to assess the level of air pollution in a particular area. It's important to note that air quality can vary significantly day to day, and these rankings may have changed. So here are the 10 most polluted Asian cities according to Air Quality Index. Number 10, Tianjin, China. Tianjin, a major port city in China, is also heavily industrialized and experiences high levels of pollution as a result. The city is a major producer of steel and cement, and the production of these materials is a significant source of pollution in the area. Number 9, Shenyang, China. Shenyang, a city in northeastern China, is another heavily industrialized city. The city is a major producer of heavy machinery and is also home to a number of steel mills. The emissions from these industries contribute significantly to the city's pollution problem. Number 8, Wuhan, China. Wuhan, a city in central China, is a major transportation hub and is also home to a number of industrial facilities. The city has experienced high levels of pollution due to these factors, as well as seasonal factors such as dust storms. Number 7, Faisalabad, Pakistan. Faisalabad, a city in Pakistan, is also heavily industrialized and experiences high levels of pollution as a result. The city is a major textile manufacturing center, and the production of textiles is a significant source of pollution in the area. Number 6, Noida, India. Noida, a satellite city of Delhi, is also heavily polluted due to its proximity to the capital city. The city experiences similar sources of pollution, including vehicular traffic and industrial emissions. Number 5, Delhi, India. Delhi, the capital city of India, has also consistently ranked among the most polluted cities in Asia. The city experiences high levels of pollution due to vehicular traffic, industrial emissions, and construction activity. The city has implemented a number of measures to address the problem, including the implementation of the odd-even rule, which restricts the use of private vehicles on alternate days based on the last digit of the license plate number. Number 3 and Number 4, Lahore and Gujranwala, Pakistan. Gujranwala and Lahore, both in Pakistan, are also heavily polluted. Like other cities in the region, industrialization and vehicular traffic are significant sources of pollution. The cities also experience seasonal factors, such as crop burning and dust storms, that exacerbate the pollution problem. Number 2, Hotan, China. Hotan, China, is the second most polluted city in Asia, and it is located in the Xinjiang Uyghur Autonomous Region in the northwest of the country. The region is home to a significant number of coal-fired power plants, and the burning of coal is a major source of pollution in the area. Number 1, Ghaziabad, India. Ghaziabad, India, has consistently ranked as the most polluted city in Asia in recent years. It is located in the national capital region of India, which is a major contributor to air pollution in the country. The region is heavily industrialized, and the high volume of vehicular traffic is a significant source of pollution. The pollution is exacerbated by seasonal factors such as crop burning and temperature inversion, which trap pollutants in the atmosphere. Air pollution is a looming threat to the health and well-being of people worldwide. In Asia, the problem is particularly acute, with some cities struggling to provide residents with breathable air. The 10 most polluted cities mentioned in this video are examples of how complex and multidimensional this issue is. From industrial emissions to crop burning and transportation, there are many sources of air pollution that need to be addressed to improve the situation. The good news is that many of these cities are taking steps to tackle the problem. From implementing vehicle restrictions to investing in renewable energy and green infrastructure, there are a variety of measures being taken to reduce air pollution. However, it is not just up to governments and policymakers to solve this problem. It is also up to individuals to take action to reduce their own impact on the environment. Small changes, such as using public transportation, reducing energy consumption, and adopting a plant-based diet, can make a significant difference in improving air quality. If you like what you watch, 
hit the like button to show your support. More importantly, subscribe to this channel so that you will continue to receive interesting videos about Asia.